Now let's talk about the next question. This is the next question we have. It says an element has a face centered cubic structure with a cell edge of A. The distance between the centers of two nearest tetrahedral voids in the lattices. The options are 3 by 2A, A by 2, A, root 2A. These are the four options we have. Students, if I talk about tetrahedral voids, these voids are located at the center of each octant. The octant is eighth part of a cube. Now, if I consider the top view, so if I am considering the top view of the face centered lattice, so what will be the top view here? This is the top view where if I consider the tetrahedral voids, the tetrahedral voids will be at the center. Assuming the edge length equal to A, we can consider the distance between these two points and that will be A by 2. Distance between two tetrahedral voids will be A by 2. So, the correct answer for this question will be option 2. Now, let us move to the next question. This is the next question we have. It says glucose and galactose are having identical configuration in all the positions except position. For options are C2, C5, C3 and C4. Students, if I talk about glucose and galactose, these are C4 epimers. So, the correct answer is given in option 4. Hence, the correct answer for this question will be option 4. Now, let us move to the next question. This is the next question we have. It says, the metal that gives hydrogen gas upon treatment with both acid as well as base is. The options are zinc, magnesium, iron, mercury. These are four options. Students, if I talk about metal which can give hydrogen gas upon reaction with acids as well as bases are amphoteric metals. So, out of the given option only zinc is amphoteric in nature. So, the correct answer for this question will be zinc. Let us write the reactions. Zinc plus HCl this gives you ZnCl2 plus H2. We can balance this reaction and zinc plus NaOH gives you Na2ZnO2 sodium zincate plus H2. So, the correct answer for this question will be option 1. Now, let us move to the next question.